How to install the Beautify theme on Shopify step by step. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. I hope you all are doing great and are having an amazing and absolutely incredible day. I bring you back with yet another video and in this video we're going to be talking about the Beautify, a Shopify theme that's quite popular and a lot of people like to mess around with that theme. And I'm going to be showing you how you can download that theme and after you've downloaded that theme. I'm also going to be talking about how you can integrate it with your Shopify store and how you can work with it deeply. Okay. And by deeply, I mean how you can work with its uh, in-depth analysis, how you can uh, work with all the features of it, how you can edit those features and a whole lot more. So please do make sure to fully watch this video till the end so you can get the whole idea of how this stuff works. So yeah, uh, without further ado, let's get straight into this video. Now to start things off, what you are going to be doing is you're going to go ahead into your Shopify store. And once you go into your Shopify store, you're going to come to your themes. Okay. Now, once you've come to your themes over here, you're going to go into learn about more about themes. Okay. Or you can just go ahead and click on visit theme store. Now, once you visit your theme store, I'm just uh, going to wait for this to load up. There we go. So once you visit your theme store, it's going to open up the whole theme store over here where you can actually search different themes for yourself and a whole lot more. So I'm going to go ahead and search up the beautify or you can just search up debut. And uh, in the case that it doesn't give you the beautify, let's click on it again. You can go ahead, search it in again. Now in most regions, it will give you the beautify theme. Okay. But in the situation and uh, in the case that it does not give you the Debutify theme, you can always go ahead and search it over to your Google. So you can search Debutify theme. Okay. There you've gotten the Debutify theme. And as you can see, it gives you these different themes for yourself. So if it doesn't give you this theme to download on Shopify, you can just go to Debutify.com. And over there, they give you the option to take this theme. Obviously, this theme has a free trial, so you're going to have to book it. But uh, yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and do that. Add in your name. And then it's going to ask you for an email address. And uh, when it asks you for an email address, just go ahead and input the email address that you have. Because obviously, without the email address, you will not be able to access the Debutify themes. So uh, once wait, I'm just going to go ahead and add my name. Okay. Then we're going to add the email address and then we're going to add the password. So once you've added all of this, you're going to click on create my account. And once you click on create my account, it takes you to the basic sign up onboarding. So first of all, it's going to send you a code to your email to verify your email address. And uh, once you verified, verified your email address, uh, what we're going to do from there is, uh, you know, get our account started and up running. So obviously, once you've got your account set it up, let me show you what it looks like. So this is what it looks like. You get the whole thing going on. So I'm going to go ahead and click on download theme. OK, now what download theme will do is obviously it's going to download the theme for me. And as it downloads the theme for me, you're going to need to connect your store as well. So we're going to click on connect store and it's going to ask me for my store URL. Obviously, I'm going to come here. This is I'm just going to open up my store. So this is my store URL. I'm going to copy it up and now we are going to go back to Debutify. OK, uh, just uh, real quick, we're going to go do this. Click on paste and now we're going to click on connect to my Shopify store. All you're going to need to do is, you know, add your URL and now your store is connected there. There you can see the store is connected. Now you're going to click on download. OK, it says update to 5.02 or fresh install. I would like to download the latest version or I'm already using Debutify theme. OK, I'm going to go with the latest version. And once you go with the latest version, click on continue. And there you go. It starts preparing your download. And that is how you're going to connect it. Now, over here, what you're going to do is you're going to wait for this theme to download over here. You're going to open up the zip file that you have in front of you. And once you open up the zip file, let me show you what awaits you. So I'm just going to go here. Uh, let's open up the zip file. And uh, in the zip file, basically, let me show you what you get. So let me just extract the zip file. We're going to go to downloads. Once you're going to go to downloads, we're going to bring it here, extract. Once you extract it, open it up. 
open it up again. First, it gives you Mac OS, but obviously we don't want Mac. We need not want the normal one. And here you get the different assets for the theme that you have for your Shopify, right? So how are you actually going to go ahead and add this to your Shopify? Let me show you. So you're going to go to Shopify themes. Okay. And you're going to visit the theme store. Now, once you visit the theme store to Shopify over here is where you can upload your very own custom theme. So to add a whole theme, uh, you're going to click like in the theme library section over here. If you can't find add themes, you can just come back over here. And once you come back over here, uh, in the case that it doesn't give you add the theme option, you can obviously go ahead and upgrade your account. For me, it gives me over here. So I'm going to click on upload zip file, click on add file. Now, obviously, I have the zip file over here, so I'm going to do that. I'm going to click on upload file and it's going to upload the theme straight into my Shopify. So I'm just going to wait for it to load up. And once things have properly loaded up and everything is good to go from there, there you go. So my Deputify theme is now installing into my Shopify. So that is exactly what I wanted. And everything seems to be, you know, running on a smooth pace. So once all of this is, uh, you know, properly done and everything is good to go, what you are going to do from there on out is you're going to basically connect everything. You're going to start customizing it. You're going to start uh, editing it. And then you can obviously publish it with uh, messing around with all the features you have. So here we go. Now, what you're going to do is you're going to click on customize when Stubutify loads up. So my Debutify has loaded up. We're going to go straight into this and there we are. So this is your Debutify theme that you can customly add from the Debutify website. And uh, obviously you can start editing this with all the different things that it has. You can click on it, you know, select some type of random image that you want to add. Let's say I'm going to add this image that I have. Click on done. It's going to add the swoosh image. Then just edit it as you do in any, in any normal Shopify store that you have. And yeah, that's basically about it for this tutorial. So that is how you are going to be connecting your Shopify store to your uh, basic Debutify. So I hope this tutorial was extremely helpful to you. And uh, if you need any more videos like this, please do tell me I am always available and I will give you the easiest step to step guides for any type of videos that you demand. And uh, if you have any queries regarding this video, you can let me know down in the comments. And uh, yeah, I guess I'll see you next time. Before signing off, please like and subscribe to the channel and uh, leave down a nice comment if you watch the video. And please don't forget to share this video with uh, any of your friends in need or your family. And uh, I hope you all have a great day. So until next time, I'll see you later and goodbye.